Hi, it's Pamela. In this tutorial, we're going to use ChatGPT to create a holiday script for Doodly. Hey, and welcome to the official Doodly YouTube channel. If you enjoy our content, please click the like and subscribe button below. Now let's get straight to the video. Ho, ho, ho! With the holidays in full swing, it's time to create our annual holiday greeting video to share on social media. Not sure what to say? Not feeling creative? No worries. ChatGPT to the rescue. So you'll see here that I have a little Christmas greeting that GPT made for me. And it did it in about five seconds flat. So I'm going to show you how you can do the same. Okay, so head on over to chat.openai.com. And I do have ChatGPT4 because I have the paid account. So I'm going to use that. And I'm just going to type in. It's giving me two choices, which it does sometimes. I don't like this one where it's pretending to be frosty. So I'm gonna say I like this one better and I'm gonna ask it to shorten it. And that's one of the neat things about this is you can just continue the conversation and fine tune it until it's exactly what you have in mind. One thing I forgot to do is tell it we're doing it for a business. So. What I'm going to do is I'm going to say, thank you. This is close. Please don't mention Frosty. It will be from a company called Widgets. So now it's going to redo this from the perspective of a company. And I think that's fine. That'll be good enough. So I'm going to go ahead and copy and paste this. And we'll go back into Doodly and let's create our video. Let's go to my videos, create new video. We'll call it Holiday Greetings 2023. And I'm going to get my text. Let's just take this one. It's a word wrap. And obviously, it needs to draw on much, much slower. And now let's get some festive stuff in here. So I know we have a snowman, so I'm going to type in snow. I like this Christmas snowman. And of course we need our logo. What I'm envisioning is something like this, but with the logo inside. So this come down with the logo inside so we're gonna have to either create this or find it on a stock media site so I'm gonna go to free pick and let's type in ornament and I just want vectors so I'm gonna go ahead and download this right click and I'm gonna open it with pixel mater pro you could use whichever editing tool you use. It's just the one I happen to have and like. And here it is. I'm going to remove the background and I'm going to do the same in this one. Just take selection tool and get rid of this little guy. I'm sorry, cute little reindeer. I'm going to keep you, but I need something else. I'm going to crop this so that I'm only working with this one item. So now I just need to get some color in this ball here. So I'm gonna choose my shape, my circle shape. Right now it's gray. I will change it in just a moment. I'm gonna send that behind. And then what color do we want it to be? It can be white or it could be festive. A red. I'm just gonna make it white for now and that will be fine. So I'm gonna go ahead and export it back to Doodly and delete this now. And I want to upload Christmas ball. I'm gonna bring it in here. I'm gonna send it behind my widget now. And I think I'm going to delete the little reindeer this time. 
Let's go back to free pick and let's just get a background so it's just not white. This might be pretty. I'm going to use this one. Add new. And I'm just going to find my file. And let's give it a name. And now we're just going to size it here. Something like that will be good. Now we need to put it behind everything. And that's looking really nice. Now if we preview this, you're going to notice quite a few things that we're going to need to change. So let's just do that real quick. First, it's going to scribble the background on, and I don't want that. This will be fine. I think the pace of it is about right, so I'm okay with that. Then the hand's going to erase the background before it puts on our other graphics, and I'm not going to like that. I guarantee it, because <laughs> I never do. So that, I don't like that. And then that, I don't like that that okay so how do we fix that first we'll start with the background so it's selected right now click pencil I'm gonna choose fade so instead of that scribble on diagonal it's just gonna fade on nicely and it doesn't need three seconds to do it half a second is fine again this is fine and then this scribbled on so go down here to settings in the lower left Erase mode. This is what we want to turn off. Currently it's in smart mode. I'm turning it off. If you want to change the hand while we're here, let's do a cartoon hand and choose Santa. Apply. And since I turned erasing off for that, it will affect that as well. So this ball, let's draw it on. So pencil icon. And we're just going to start you think how would it draw on probably like that so we're going to start at the top down here and see the red needs to be a little fatter not too fat because we don't want to get these little parts here showing so like about that and let's see probably go here and then new path and let's just start right here and we're going to trace this and I can make this one a little bit better okay so save and return and you'll see now the hand will draw that okay it's looking pretty good I do want to mention that this background and um, ornament that I got off of free pick I do have the premium account, so I don't need to put a credit at the end. If you're using the free account, be sure and check the licensing requirements. You will need to give attribution to FreePick for that. Okay, the last thing we want to do is add some music. And you know what, let's add some time at the end. So go here, scene settings, and let's, let's put like 10 seconds at the end. So music. I did download some music for another video that I'm just going to reuse. Got this from Audio Hero, I believe. And I'm just going to reuse it. It's too long, so I'm going to shrink it. So you'll need to use either some of the built in music that comes with Doodly. Here, I'm going to right click, fade out, stretch it or download your own music from a royalty-free music site. I don't believe that Doodly has anything that sounds holiday-like in its music library. Okay, I think that's pretty much it. Let's take a quick look and then we'll be done.
have it. That's how you can use ChatGPT for some inspiration for this year's holiday video. I hope this gives you some ideas. Thank you for watching.